Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm back with another video. Tonight I'll be showing you the difference between the Fig Inc. WWF Intercontinental Heavyweight Wrestling Championship on the left and the New Generation WWE Intercontinental Heavyweight Wrestling Championship belts. Alright. Here we go. So right here on the left, this is the Fig Inc. title. It has been re-leathered by AJ's belt. Uh, these have two millimeter plates. And the main plate has been curved. So if you see here, it is a nice belt. It's very nice looking. It is very basic. It doesn't have a whole lot of detail. The strap is nice too. It's a nice leather. That's the sixth plate here, WWF Intercontinental. And the, the snap box here, gold tip. Alright, it's a very nice replica, it's a nice belt. Alright, but let's compare it to the new generation here. Now, this has also been re leathered. by Chad Smith very nice leather detail very nice leather work now these plates have are the four millimeter plates and as you can see the etching is a much deeper it's a little more detail beautiful belt all right and if you take a look at here etching is very shallow look at both of them you can see the one on top looks a little bit more like the real belt per se as opposed to this one the fig ink belts, yeah, as you can see, even the paint isn't entirely symmetrical. Yeah, the fig ink plates weren't the best plates when you look back on them. I mean, these plates are pretty old, considering. Quite a few years old, maybe... Let's say 15 years to 20 years old. Alright. And the new generation is fairly new. Alright, let's take a look at the back. It's a very basic back here by AJ's belts. It looks nice. Alright. Nice backing here by Chad Smith. Alright. And the, the leather is fairly the same as far as flexibility. Definitely recommend re-leathering your belts. I can't stress that enough. These stock straps on these belts are just pretty much horrible. All right. 
So just look at the new generation here, even like the stars here, they come out more. That's with the deeper etching, the globe. This is the network logo. Alright. If you take a look at this, the etching is much more shallow. See the globe is flat. I totally recommend getting the new generation belt over the fig ink looking back on it like the fig ink was awesome in its day but as time goes on you can see definitely want to get more detail out of the belts and this is pretty close to the real thing but um if you want to go to the next level, you're talking thousands of dollars. So at a fraction of that, I mean, you can't go wrong with this. This is gorgeous. All right. Definitely check out my all my other videos. I have quite a few replica belts. I have prank videos. Definitely check out the Fandu... Arm Wrestling Competition of Champions, which is a comedy. And definitely like, share, comment, and subscribe. Enjoy the rest of your night, ladies and gentlemen.